Another change to the mask policy in the school district of Philadelphia, and it means students and parents will have to follow some new rules. So Chris, what's the update? Well, Shane, you know, we all own a mask like this, a cloth mask. We probably own a lot of them, right? Well, Philadelphia school students are being told this alone is not enough. You better make it two. It has been determined that cloth masks alone are not uh, effective in preventing the spread of COVID-19. It is another lesson in the ever-changing rule book of fighting COVID-19 in the classroom. Cloth masks alone are no longer allowed in Philadelphia public schools. A surgical style disposable mask must be worn underneath. The preferred mask in school now, the KN95. Non-compliance will get you a trip to the principal's office and may be sent home. I had the surgical mask where you put it on and you cover your nose and your mouth, you press it down, then you can put on another mask over top of it. It just it's just two layers to help help you stay safe. Parents say following the mask rules has been challenging for their kids in school, but they're just happy their kids are in school. Keep them all safe, keep the children safe. It's about their safety. So better safe than sorry. A good thing to protect them. It's a good thing. We are simply following the guidelines from the public health experts who obviously know best how we can all stay safe to continue to have in-person learning available for our students, which is the best way for our children to learn. Now, starting Monday, the district will make available those KN95 masks to district employees, teachers and staff in schools all across the city, guys. All right. Thank you, Chris.